On it, right there. This doesn't. Hey, this something's very wrong here. I bet. Something is very, very wrong here. Very, very wrong. You know, this, this town reminds me of it. It reminds me of Centralia when the government paid the people to leave to evacuate the town. Yep. This, this isn't right. There's. Regardless of the fact that it's in the middle of nowhere, it just doesn't seem right. It's, it's a ghost town. Yeah. This is literally a ghost town. This is literally town. a ghost town. The sun is setting. And uh, it's definitely getting creepier out here. And we are the only vehicle around, and this is kind of scary if you ask me. No wonder they say if you break down or do whatever, you better have food and water to last you a couple days until somebody can get to you. Let me tell you, they're not kidding. We're going to pull off up here where they say that uh, there's been a lot of paranormal stuff going on. It's called Coyote Summit, about 6,000 feet above sea water. So probably and we're gonna sit and wait for a while and watch the friendly skies and do a lot of listening senses and see what me and madam come up with I don't know there's a feeling of heaviness right now like I just got this feeling of right we shouldn't be here uh, maybe uh, time to leave the aliens will come abduct us because we are the only ones on this road for miles and miles and miles and miles. This is just crazy. Uh. I honestly feel like it's it's kind of like what's inside of the mountains that's here. Okay, we're coming up on yeah. it. Looks like the Coyote Summit here. We're going to pull in here. This is a pull off where some people go and try to catch some paranormal activity. I just want to make a note too, um, in case we disappear. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Let me find our camera. Ah, just joking. It is now 73 degrees out here. Right, and in Las Vegas, it's probably still 90. 94, 73, man, it, and it feels cold. I never really realized the extremities of the desert like that. 